Welcome back Ninjago fans to another live reaction with Hungry Harmony and these are the new like I guess spin-off trailers to the Dragons Rising now that I know that that's the new title of um, the new season that's coming out, so my bad. I thought it was United, but looks like they changed it, or I don't know what the mix-up was. But thank you guys in the comments for letting me know that. So, um, yeah, so the new like little teaser trailers or spin-offs are coming out or right now on Lego, like on the Lego um, YouTube channel. So I'm gonna watch as many as they have come out right now, which will lead into the new season. So I don't want to keep you guys waiting. Let's get started to the reaction. Let's go. Dragons Rising, let's go! Everything feels so familiar. What's your voice? Whose voice is this? And yet, nothing is the same. What the heck is. Okay, we're going really modern, Ninjago, unless this is. <gasps> Wait, those are the mountains from the trailer. These must be different dimensions. New worlds have risen. New worlds, okay. So not dimensions, but worlds? Great. Oh dear. New heroes? Why? What's wrong with our old heroes? Am I watching Ninjago? Honestly, I don't recognize this. Is this Ninjago? This dragon's rising. Um, no, that's not Ninjago. Th this is not Ninja. What are we looking at? If this is about the other worlds, if this is an introdu introduction to the other worlds, maybe. But this doesn't seem. I don't get Ninjago vibe from this. The only thing that's related to Ninjago are dragons. So I'm just like, what is going on here? I don't. This for me, like, this is a teaser trailer one. Together we will rise. Who are these together? New heroes? What happened to our old heroes? If we're like kind of doing like an Avengers kind of thing, like, you know, taking from different like movies or in this case, like different shows, like I wouldn't be surprised if, you know, Legends of Chima and Ninjago just mix together to fight a common goal. That would kind of make sense to me. But this makes no sense because we have no idea who these characters are unless they're from a different like Lego show then maybe but I have no idea and this is very confusing and that's when it happened. why are you smiling yeah I remember this part that's in junk who's this character who's as I saw my small neighborhood disappear and a new city show up on the horizon I realized I had witnessed the merge first his neighborhood disappear, but a new city merged. Are you from Ninjago? Or are you from a different world, and then Ninjago City is the one that just planned it into your neighborhood? Hey, Questions. The moment all the mysterious realms I had only heard about merged with Ninjago. For reasons no one's been able to figure out. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Explanations right there. Holy Freaking Ninjago, this is amazing. Look at all that detail. Okay, I see two pyramids on the bottom left corner. That looks like a tent on the bottom right corner. There's a castle in the middle of it. There's a volcano on the right. There's... That's Borg Tower. That's obviously Ninjago. The two dragons. I feel like it's two large, like, big creatures sleeping. That's Ninjago making the yin-yang kind of symbol. And on the left is another... It looks like... It almost looks like, um, um, Italy. Like, on the left, Italy, like, backwards. Um, or upside down. Um, and at the top left corner of the houses... Um, that looks like a big city as well on the top that's connecting to Ninjago's like back kind of thing I guess interesting interesting I like it I like it I'm kind of getting like a different like world as in like country vibe like say you know Ninjago say is you know uh, China Japan it's kind of like mixture of it kind of like that but then up there looks like Tokyo with the little cool tower so I'm like woo. And then on the bottom right corner with the castle reminds me of Europe, the European castle. So I should know I'm from there. But then the bottom right looks like tents or maybe like somewhere maybe in the cold area, maybe. But on the right we see volcanoes, which could be lava, a lot of lava, a lot of like, um, um, like there's definitely a volcano. There's probably, it's almost like, uh, what's the, well, like death mountain in like, uh, Legend of Zelda. So like, you know, lava, rocks, mountains, beautiful. 
And then on the bottom left corner where you see the, the little pyramid, probably the desert area. I'm not sure about the one that's in the center that what I said looked like a backwards Italy or weird Italy um, looking kind of country, but interesting. I like maybe it could be something like from in like in somewhere in Asia or in India kind of like something but I'm not really familiar with that type of style of, of buildings but yeah sorry I'm going all out this is exciting um but yeah looks like all the realms are I'm guessing worlds are coming together different places I guess it looks interesting I can imagine this being one big puzzle and they just all break apart like they look like they could almost fit together like a puzzle no okay I'll continue sorry I survived I was alone. I am sorry. Everyone I ever knew had vanished. That is sad. Oh, your bed. Is that the only thing that's left from you? Oh. A bird from your home? No. Oh. Lloyd. What the? No, no, no. Go back. Go back. They were jumping. They were jumping. Okay. That looks like freaking Lloyd. That's Lloyd. That's definitely Lloyd. The dragon on the right, sure. Um, I think these are all characters from different realms. Even the top left corner seems like a... a... That's a ninja too! That's an orange ninja, which maybe is him. And the person in the middle, I have no freaking idea, which I don't, I don't know. Cat? Weird. I mean, you know, I mean, I would love it if Akita came back. If Akita came back, I would be so happy. Um, but yeah, that's Lloyd. But you know what's interesting is that the symbol on the on the bottom left of his, like, it looks like a circle, almost looks like the New York Sanctum in Doctor Strange. Am I the one who's seeing that? The New York Sanctum from Doctor Strange. Maybe. I don't know. I like it. I mean, I'm, I'm a huge Doctor Strange fan, but... Mm, it's a speech. Dragon's rising. <sighs> See, I don't know if this is like gonna be. Your capture was successful. Who the heck are you guys? Are you a lion? Are you a tiger? Are, are you a saber tiger? Me, or are you a dragon? Okay, Cyclops. Do not disappoint me. Cool. Lord Raz doesn't sound like he's got a lot of faith in us. He's too uptight. We're the best there is at rounding out these animals. Uh, your overconfidence is a weakness. <laughs> now, let me tell you, I've never even heard the word weakness. Really? It's I... a pretty common word. <laughs> no, I, 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 mean, I, just I get what you mean, but that was weakness. a good joke. Seriously? I, I can explain. <laughs> weakness. Now, the quality of... Uh, Dictionary. Webster Dictionary. <laughs> nah. That is definitely a dragon. And I see that symbol again. Gotcha. Still have not gotten any explanation. Okay. Your name. We didn't know what to call it. Oh, so this is his neighborhood. Okay. So, his neighborhood was the center of the merch. Gotcha. Which is where the ninja probably gonna save them. Because they're all merging. Yeah, let's go. Ah! <laughs> Who the heck are you? Anime girl. And who are you? What happened to you, Lloyd? Okay. You're so not a ninja. Definitely not. Trust me, we have to stop them. Aaron, what would the ninja do? I hope this is the only thing the merge did take from me. That's cute. That is so cute. Okay, what power do you have? Also, I don't think I ever caught your name. So, yeah. 
Well, okay, guys. Um, that was everything that um, they have uploaded so far, to my knowledge. Unless they're gonna upload something today. But um, to be honest, I'm kind of disappointed in only this reason. I don't think they should label this as an Injago thing. If they're introducing new characters, new realms, sure, that's okay, but introduce it as Ninjago first, then add the other realms and all this merge that's gonna happen. This is what I'm seeing here. What they showed me right now is more of a new show and then Ninjago's just, just like a side character, like a side help. Does that make sense? Like I, I feel like like Dragons Rising is is what the new show is called, not the new season. Does that make sense? I feel like Dragon Dragons Rising is gonna be like a new Lego show, and then they're just putting Ninjago on the side of it. Does that make sense to like put the label there so like people will watch it? Why do I get the feeling that's what they're doing and this is not going to be a legit season? Like, a legit Ninjago season. Because Ninjago season is all about the ninja and the new villains they face. If these guys are the new villains, coolio. But why introduce two new characters right from the start? Like, why introduce this new thing without any kind of explanation? Like, I'm hoping how they always do the Ninjago. We start with Ninjago. We start with Ninjago. We start with Jay or Kai or Nia, Lloyd, Zane, Cole, like, doing their everyday business. Like, we literally started with Cole with Shintaro. Like, with season 13, we started with Cole. And then with, um, we started with, uh, Jay and Nia, I think, from the start with se season 14 or season 15, whichever, Seabound, I think. I'm trying to remember. But most of the times, it always starts with the ninja. And then they go on an adventure and they start everything. Like, you know, that, that's how, like, everything goes down. But if we're starting a season, a Ninjago season, with already the merge happening, the, the catastrophe happening, and or introducing a new realm or new, new people, like, new characters already, and then we get to Ninjago, that sounds like a different show to me. I feel like this could be a crossover, like a crossover season. But don't label it Ninjago if we're not starting with Ninjago. Does that make sense? As a story aspect and what Ninjago has done in the past, I don't see this as a Ninjago season. I see this as a crossover. And honestly, I'm not really excited about it. I was before when they showed me the first trailer, which I saw. But this, nope, nope. Honestly, do not care about this, these characters. These new ones, not even the dragons. The cute one was really cute. But I honestly don't care. The one thing I got scared was when seeing Lloyd's like headband. Like I thought, wait, is this like, like thousands of years into the future? Like that, that like not thousands, but like <laughs> that looked like a ninja. Like that looked like Lloyd who passed away, and then his like ninja mat bandana mask just was floating in the wind, like just as a memory. Like oh yeah, back in these days there were ninjas, and there was the green ninja named Lord Garmadon. Like that kind of thing and then like oh this is his headpiece from when he became the green ninja kind of thing that what it looked like with the flowing thing and, and the new character putting it on his head that's what it looked like that's kind of the vibe I got why I feel really disappointed what they just did right now so I hate to say it but I'm not excited now I'm kind of glad I'm re-watching Ninjago because those were the glory days and still they are but now they're not I, I don't know what they're doing right now. And I'd love to hear from you guys in the comments what you guys think about that. Because I'm really concerned. Super duper concerned on what they're going to do. Because it didn't start with the ninja. They had teasers, of course, but as long, no offense, but as long as it starts with the ninjas and it's mostly about the ninjas and maybe saving these new characters, that's fine. But if these new characters are not going to become like, oh, maybe the next generation of ninjas, like, that'd be really cool. Like, okay, let's learn who these new characters can give us. But if they're not, if that's not the aim of the, the season or the story, I just see this as Lego, Dragons Rising, spin-off, Ninjago. Or like, side, or, or like, side characters, Ninjago, in small, like, small letters. That's what I'm worried about. Like, Every other season was like, like, um, 
Let's see. Ninjago crystallized. All about the ninja. Ninjago sea bound. Like, you know, that makes sense. Like, Ninjago Shintaro. Like, Ninjago. Everything. From, like, season one all the way to season crystallize. Now it's, I feel like, dragons rising. Ninjago. No? That's how I feel. But I hope it will be a, a, a Ninjago season, not a crossover of something or something new that just has Ninjago as a side like slap like oh yeah it almost like like a like a like a what's it called like an ad like oh like buy this and like oh it's from like this like i don't know like, like i don't know i don't know but i'm really worried i'm not excited for this season i'm not and that's what makes me sad i was excited to see like what's gonna go what's gonna happen because the first trailer was all about the ninjas i love that Focus on the ninja, because this is Ninjago. This is like the main ninja we're focusing on, going on their new adventure. Who the heck are these characters? And what what do they have to give? Or what is, are they gonna be like the damsels in distress? I'm not saying they're damsels in distress, but I'm saying like, are they gonna be the plot of the ninja having to save these guys? Or is it gonna be like main focus of this and ninja helping? Again, like, dragons rising, Ninjago. NEW CHARACTERS! Ninja! Helping on the side! Again, no, I'm sorry I'm re repeating myself, but that's how I truly feel that this is... This is what this teasers and trailers are showing me. I hope that's not the case. So, I pray that it's a Ninjago season. Ninjago! Dragons Rising. NINJAGO! Dragons Rising. You know, NINJAGO! Crystallize. NINJAGO! See about not dragons rising. Ninjago. Sorry, I keep doing that. I think it's really funny to say Ninjago. <laughs> um, but yeah, that's my reaction. That's my thoughts. I'd love to hear from you guys in the comments below what your thoughts on these on these new trailers and teasers are. I'm afraid it's gonna be a huge disappointment, and I hope it's not that. So. Again, please let me know what, uh, please share your thoughts in the comments below. Please let me know what you guys think. I'd love to hear from you guys, and maybe you guys agree or maybe you disagree. Please, I'd love to hear your thoughts on what is this new nin Ninjago season has to give us with dragons rising kind of thing. So, yeah. Mm. So, that's all I'm going to say today. So, thank you guys for watching and listening. I apologize this wasn't so much of a exciting reaction, but... To be honest, this is what I got, so I'm like, okay. But, sorry. <laughs> I'll end it here. Thank you guys, and hope you guys have a wonderful rest of your Ninjago Wednesday. Hunger Harmony is gonna be out. But remember, jump up, kick back, whip around, and spin. Ninjago! Sensei will beside you. Ninja, go, go.